Understanding Market Indicators, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to delve into a very interesting topic in the world of finance and economics, market indicators. We'll explore what they are, why they're important, and how they are used in the real world. Let's get started. Market indicators are statistical metrics used to understand and predict the direction of financial markets. They can be numbers, trends, or graphical representations. Think of them like the vital signs for markets. Just like how a doctor checks your heartbeat and temperature, investors and economists use market indicators to check the health of the financial markets. There are two primary types of market indicators, leading and lagging indicators. Leading indicators, these predict future movements of the market. They change before the economy as a whole changes, giving a forecast of what might happen. Lagging indicators, these confirm the patterns and trends that are already occurring. They change after the economy changes, offering a historical report of what has happened. To make this concept clearer, let's look at some common market indicators. Stock market indexes, like the Dow Jones or S&P 500, these show the performance of a selection of stocks, representing a specific market segment. Gross domestic product, GDP, measures the total value of goods and services produced over a specific time period. Consumer price index, CPI, reflects the changes in the cost of living by measuring the prices of consumer goods. Market indicators are used by investors, policymakers, and business leaders to make informed decisions. For example, a rising GDP might indicate a healthy economy, prompting investors to buy stocks. Conversely, a high CPI could suggest inflation, leading to different investment strategies. We hope this video has shed some light on the concept of market indicators. Remember, understanding these indicators is key to grasping how the financial world operates. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to seeing you in our next English learning session.